Hello everybody, welcome to Daily Entomologist and uh, just uh, continuing on the collection here. Uh, so again, going to be a little short video just going over the progress I've been making. Um, and uh, yeah. So I kind of started uh, going through more uh, random beetles. Um, Although, I did do some uh, specific groups again, so. Here's some, uh, going through the finished ones first. Uh, we have some Colionathus species. Got Colionathus basalis. And uh, then down here we have uh, Pennsylvanicus, the most common species in the, my collection. I um, have a couple more Colionathus over here. We have Marginatus and Deceptus. Uh, we got uh, Trichodes, Ornatus, Natali. Euphoria Enda, Bumble Scarab, got some striped blister beetles, Epicata, um, I'm going through other Epicata right now, so, I really like the genus Epicata, I don't, I don't know why, I like blister beetles in general, so, I'm really excited to see all those finished up and in trays. Just a couple row of beetles there. We have a uh, Dodbane beetles, Chrysochus, Oratus. As you can see, absolutely beautiful species. There's some more western species uh, in the same genus that I do not have in my collection yet. Hopefully I'll get it eventually. Be nice. I mean, you can never get tired of looking at that. That's just gorgeous. Always a treat to find when I'm out collecting. So, yeah. Those are some of the finished, <clears throat> excuse me, some of the finished beetles I've done so far. Now we're going to the ones I have lined up next to get labels on. Nothing really to, too showy in this one. Uh, this box is all Epicata species. So. One, two, three, four, maybe three or four, well, four or five, maybe four, maybe five species of Apicata in here from multiple states. So excited to get those finally worked on. And I have a bunch of more Apicata that don't have, that I'm need to put labels on still but those won't be too problem I don't have to make new labels for them so those will go quick um net spots more epicata than just more random stuff here just to get them out of the way Obviously, the ones of note in here. See, I click beetle, giant staghorn, rainbow scarab, ox beetle, couple net wing beetles there, uh, Maloi genus, uh, oil beetles, Passamacus elongatus, 
just uh, other few things in there. And then uh, got these as well lined up for labels. And then these as well. They'll just get added to what is here. But yeah. So those are what's next lined up to get new labels. I'll start getting those made today and then work on them throughout this week. Um, today also, to close out this uh, update video, I've pinned out all the Orthoptera that I collected in October. Which have include which is pretty much everything I've caught. Um, the last couple collection videos that I put up, um, showing a lot of orthopter in there. So these are uh, everything. All the orthopterans collected this October. Nice to get them done and pinned out and everything. There's a couple other non orthopterans in here as well. Well, if you've seen this video, you remember me finding uh, these specimens. And yeah. That's pretty much, uh... Everything I wanted to go over in this particular video. So, making progress, getting stuff I need. I like the steady and eh, medium pace, but I'm happy with the progress I'm making. Uh, the species I have, everything's looking good. So, hopefully, uh, just continue working and yeah so I think that's gonna be it for this video uh, just a couple small things so hope you enjoyed comment like subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one